Nowadays, YouTube is full of sensationalist titles like the one you just clicked on, but I'm happy to say I can actually back this one up. This mod is called Axiom, and it's about to completely revolutionize building in Minecraft. During this video, we're gonna take a look at three ways this completely changes the game, and we're even gonna have a quick chat with the developers. But first, a bit of background. For basically as long as I can remember, all we've had in Minecraft are tools like World Edit and Archeon. And don't get me wrong, these tools are great, but they can be very limiting. See, Minecraft is what's called a voxel game. Voxel are basically just the 3D equivalent of a pixel. So in the same way that an image is made up of tons of little squares, Minecraft is made up of tons of different cubes. And so when you make a Minecraft build, you're essentially 3D modeling, but you're stuck working within the confines of the game. There's no real way to zoom out and take control the way you would in a 3D modeling software. Like, take a look at the UI for Go Paint. You need to hold a feather in your hand and then you get this menu. Not super intuitive. And most of World Edit doesn't even have a user interface. You just have to rely on hand type commands. But there are plugins plugins like Block Blender that allow you to convert objects from a 3D software to Minecraft. So why not design something in Blender and then bring it into Minecraft? Well, there are two issues. First, 3D software is just very difficult to learn. Take it from an animation student. But more importantly, it's because most 3D software uses polygons instead of voxels. This means that the objects are made out of little flat shapes that come together to form a mesh. Now there are some programs out there for 3D modeling with voxels, but none of them have ever really played nice with Minecraft. And just think about about it. There are thousands of people in the world who build in Minecraft as their full-time job, whether they're map makers, YouTubers, or server owners. These people are literally building professionals and they deserve a professional tool for building in Minecraft. And it's finally here. So for instance, if we wanted to create a, a roof to this building, we can do so very, very easily using a smear tool like this. So Axiom opened up for beta testing on August 6th and I grabbed it right away. And while I show you guys around, I wanna tell you the three reasons why I think this is so groundbreaking. Number one is accessibility. A lot of building tools are plugins, not mods, meaning they only work on servers. Not only that, but they're often paywalled. Plus it's hard to even find the commands, some of which are buried in 100 page documents that you need a Google Drive link for. Axiom is available in single player and soon will be released for servers too. The mod is super intuitive. It adds stuff right onto the Minecraft hotbar. So for example, right at the end of the hotbar, we have these builder tools. If we hold down alt, we can see there's a move, clone, stack, smear, and extrude tool. And if we just select one, they're extremely easy to understand. You get this awesome preview of what you're doing before you confirm. And one of my favorite things is you can just hit control Z to undo. By holding alt, you can also save hotbars and switch between the game modes really easily. So you can see I have some of my favorite palettes saved right on here. And then there's these little toggleable modes over here that are insanely useful. For example, Enhanced Flight gives you more precise flight in creative mode. Notice how I'm not sliding around. This slider here actually controls fly speed. Whee! The bulldozer is really fun. You can just kind of hold. One of my favorites has to be the replace mode. You can just hold down right click. Oh, it's so satisfying. And it even matches the block states. And there's a ton of other useful stuff like this force place, which kind of lets you place anything anywhere. But notice how that just popped off. If you turn on this no updates, it actually won't update the blocks either. And then last but not least, they have this tinker mode, which is kind of like the debug stick. Just super useful stuff. But we've literally just scratched the surface. The mod really opens up when you hit right shift. And this brings me to the second reason I think this mod is such a paradigm shift, the visual feedback. I cannot stress enough how clunky it feels to build using commands. Being able to see a live preview of what you are doing is so amazing. It really feels like having a huge handicap removed from the game. Which brings me to the final reason I think this mod is so insane. And that's all the new tools this mod offers. Not only does it replace a ton of other mods, but it adds tools that I've never even seen before. They've got a noise painter, where where you can preview the noise pattern that you're about to make. They have this tool called the Clentaminator, which can make these different patterns. And guys, this is literally like my first 10 minutes in this program. I can't even imagine what my workflow is gonna look like after using this for a couple months. Now, I don't wanna show you all the tools just because this isn't meant to be a tutorial. So I highly encourage you to download the mod and try it for yourself and join the Discord and give your feedback to the developers. So now that we've seen a little bit of the mod, let's give the developers a call and see what they have to say. 
Hey, what's up guys? Hello. This is Soko and Mulberry. These guys are super chill. The first thing I asked them is how Axiom got started. It originally started with me contacting Mole for a commission to make a mod that enhanced existing building tools such as World Edit and Voxel Sniper. So I wanted to help him out. I started doing some work for him and over time that grew into like a friendship. Me and Soko are working on uh, this, you know, MMORPG and just the existing tools weren't there. Soko would say, oh, I want a way to do this. And then so I'd add a way to do that. And then eventually got to a point where it's like, okay, we have this very useful tool for us. Why don't we just release it for everyone to use? And that's you know, that's where Axiom came from. As you can see, the scale of this is quite large. Like this bay over here, it's it's like another like 1500 blocks over from the city. Oh, the city's in that direction. Like that. Dude. And, and I've made this in uh, like no time basically i so want to see other builders use it just because it's changed everything about building for me it's made it more fun it's made it more possible to do large projects and i want to see what other people can do there's a lot of new tools with new algorithms that just don't exist anywhere else the smooth tool is a good example of one of them because the algorithm is completely different from any other smooth tool and the main thing we're just looking for is people to you know try out the mod and test it further down the road axiom is going to have a commercial version aimed at like professional builders so people who are you know creating like java edition servers bedrock marketplace maps like those sort of people with you know a few additional features and, and, and stuff to like suit their workflows we want to empower everyone to be able to build easier and better as well as faster so that that's our primary goal be sure to share it with your friends and uh let us know what you would like to see from us as well. There's still so much I didn't have time to talk about. You can see your undo history. You can easily change game rules. You can create complex masks for your tools. You can create complex selections and then modify those selections. You can even make blueprints of your creations that come with a rendered thumbnail and a tagging system. I want you guys to know, I am not exaggerating when I say this is about to change building forever. Thanks for watching.